Hello, I'm back again and I need to be quiet as usual. My son's just falling asleep in the next room and I wanted to show you some of these lovely treats. I've been having baths um, a lot less the last week. I've just had showers in the morning and um, I'm really looking forward to having a lovely soak this evening. And I'm going to include some bath salts here because I've hurt my back a bit so I need a bit of a salty bath today too and I'm picking a peppermint theme and minty theme and this one here says scent notes of twilight time between sunset and darkness a cold north wind the onset of snow distant campfire and marshmallow such a beautiful fresh yet lovely minty cozy scent because of the marshmallow I think that sort of sweetness and I'm also using, oh sorry, and that's Future Primitive Soap Company. And I'm also going to use, whoops, Bar Humbug Mint and Buttercream Polish. This is a really beautiful, um, lovely scrub. I'll actually show you what it looks like inside. And that one is a really creamy, delicious one. I hope you can hear me because I keep, I'll try and talk slightly louder. He's, I think he's quiet in his room at the moment. Look at that, it's pretty as well, but really sweet. And then we have the lovely Abominable by Lush. Um, this is my last one. I got a few when they came out again. And um, it's a beautiful, I got another minty scent. Really refreshing as well, but sweet too. And um, as you can see, really pretty. But... Uh, after the bath i'm really looking forward to using this solstice scents outpost this is a burnishing glaze with lasse and you can use it as a bath and body oil as you can see there and this is lovely this hasn't actually got mint in but it's got spruce and fir patchouli and it's got that sort of lovely earthy freshness and it's also got a warmth i think it's got sugared um element to it as well so it's a really gorgeous scent as you can see beautiful beautiful details there and i thought i would show you abominable dissolving and um i hope you enjoy it i hope you've been having a good week and things are getting better for you as i say if, if not and, and um yes let's have a look at this and i'll just put the lid back on this we go and we'll take the abominable to the bathroom. There we go. I just settled my youngest again, but now we're back and we'll put the abominable in. I have demoed him before and he's really creamy and as you can see, a lovely, lovely foamer. So relaxing to watch and so relaxing to smell as well. I'm glad I use all of the Lush products as fresh as I can now because I want to really enjoy them and uh, the scent is always so much stronger when it's fresher. I don't know if you can hear that lovely chirp. this sort of noise almost um, like tapping oh that's so pretty I really hope I capture it I know it's not the best light at this time but oh. <clears throat> try not to get my finger in the way there we go In a minute I'll be pouring some salts in and they should hopefully help. Oh that's so pretty. 
pretty. Round and round. Round it goes. Such pretty swirls. I'll show you. tapping from the system that actually comes and goes. There it is. It's coming this way. Lovely minty scent as well. I hope Blush do these again. It was really lovely of them to do a retro bunch that we could all pick. So, so nice. Almost glistening now. Can I show you the colours a bit? And there we go. My son's having a little chat to himself in the background there. There it goes. Really frothy, creamy. This, um, sorry, that was loud. This usually carries on for quite a while. So it's quite a nice one to actually have swirling around you. The way it looks. Blue skies and snow. I think that's a theme. Of course that they want to show us. There we go. So beautiful. The scent as well. I hope you're all having a lovely start to the week and I will be back really soon. I have a few ideas and things I want to do. So I'll make a bigger effort to actually get them done and um, review some lovely things as well. Take care.